Yeah, it's cool. I I was very honored that the developer sort of like you know reached out like that because this game is actually pretty cool and addicting. I'm I'm glad it's come to the forefront. Anyway, yeah, this is like asteroids, but you're at like the bottom of the screen and you're shooting ships coming down, but the levels progressively get harder and harder. Uh, <laughs> yeah, if you look at my score, there's 25 levels altogether and um, it gets more and more brutal as it goes on. Of course, there's someone called Cuphead and Earthsaver. Yeah, let's go. Okay, press fire to continue. And yeah, this is the game. I'm uh, pretty sure we can pause at any time too, so... But yeah, we shoot the ships, we collect power-ups, and it's a good time. It's very pretty. Uh, widescreen support as well, Abby. So, there are 25 waves. Whoops. And, uh... Enemies have shields, that the thing. Yeah, it's a two-player game. Never played it two-player, but I'd love to someday. You can also use, like, an Xbox One controller as well. Ah! Uh, no, I'm using the arrow keys and shift to shoot. I don't think there's any mouse support, though I could check. I could also use like a game pad with a joystick. Oh, the game sound is super quiet. Alright, let me um, let me chuck it up in this. Okay, let me know how this is Avocad. I've cranked it up in, um, in Streamlabs. By IG? John Syndicate. J-O-H-N, capital J-O-H-N, capital S-Y-N-D-I-C-A-K-E-T-E. If that makes sense. It's good. Okay, yeah. Audio mixing is different for like every game ever, so. It's kind of low still, you guess the game is chill, sound. Uh, yeah, it's like this all the way through, Avocad. But as long as you can, guys can hear the sound effect and music okay? Is it like okay or is it still too fucking quiet? Because I can easily adjust it again. Okay, here's the first boss. What you do is you shoot the front of it. Raise it a bit more. Okay, let me know how that is. Okay, first boss. I'm only gonna fuck around with it for a little bit. Bit more on GG. We're pushing the 90s here. The uh, 90 decibels. I don't want it too high. Okay, cool.
This game is very nostalgic to me. Like, of course this was originally a Macintosh game, so... I used to play this all the time. Okay, level 5. Pont is waiting for my response. Okay, cool. You got it right. Thank you. Okay. It's not getting bullshit just yet, but it does. It gets extremely bullshit. I'm gonna say by stage 10 or something. But yeah, the, uh, the screen just gets sort of totaled with, uh, with ship numbers. Also do background-ish. Fuck. Okay, there was a... Yeah, I think it's just one hit and you die. Little, little cucumber. Indeed. How's it going, Isacola? We're playing Meteor Storm. You love graphics like this? Yeah. The graphics really pop in this game. I quite like the style. Again, you can uh, grab this on uh, Steam. How's it going, Indiana? What's good, man? Hey. Uh, I don't think you can explain anything from what uh, Isocola says. Late 90s pre-rendered 3D graphics had their own vibe. I think they're really nice, these graphics. They're clean, you can s tell exactly what's going on. The, uh... I don't know, the gameplay's just straightforward. We'll just ignore, ignore him, yeah. He talks a lot of random stuff, Pont. Just like that. So either either play along with it or go go with it rather or just uh move on. <laughs> you say no probably not as random as Isocola. Isocola says some random stuff. It's not even like premeditated, it's just... It just sort of exists. It's uh, it's called Twitch Chat. I thought you'd be used to it by now. Lots of things coming out of Iso's mouth. Iso's your boy. He's everyone's boy. He's everyone's uh, Twitch chat companion. You know? Right, boss wave. Love the boss music, by the way. Oh shit, thought I died there. ISO gets around. Yep. 100%. <laughs> gets around in all the ways.
got a beta's bits. Thank you for the hundred bits. Really appreciate that. Amazing fact! Touching your kids. Life is a miracle indeed, yep. See, uh, with ISO's paragraphs in chat, you only have to read like three words. See, I skim read chat all the time. That's why I don't speak, it doesn't sound like I'm speaking English sometimes. Because sometimes I'm trying to keep up with chat. The trick with chat is to just skim read everything. Unless it's really, really important. And you know, it's it's high stakes of life. Thank you for the 101 bits. Plus the one. Hundred plus the one. Gotta read all? I do read all. That's how I, I keep my uh, stream alive. Off to an early start. Insta death? Are you kidding me? Dude, I got to stage five. Okay. Now I just have to kill myself. Thanks, Kant. Doggo needs to pee. All right. Is someone else gonna drop a 50,000? Yeah, I mean, that's why I had it so high. Because I, I know people would kill me immediately. I know, I, I gotta make it high, man. And I know some people have a lot of points on this uh, channel. So, you know. Good. I can get through this game. I'm just waiting for the next person who I can tell them to fuck off. Was it worth it? No! I was like five stages in. <laughs> Actually, it's... yeah. I don't know. Was it worth it? Ask yourself that. For you, yes. In my reaction, yeah. I got hookups. All right. Stage three. I've gone pretty far in this game, I think, like level fifteen or something. But, uh, yeah, it got really bullshit. I was in a uh, full zen mode when I did it too. Okay, let's try and just get there, I guess. It's fun, man. Uh, I've forgotten how much it is. I think it's like $8 on Steam, but yeah, I, I had to buy it as soon as the dev was like... By the way, this game is available on Steam. <laughs> oh, around three dollars, nice. Okie dokie. Shit. Yeah, of course I was gonna grab it. 
Yeah. Yeah, within currency. Within reason of currency. Okay. I mean, the game is literally just this. The only thing that really changes is the background, but, uh, it's extremely addictive. And, um, it's a nice challenge to see how far you can get. Because the game only gives you, like, one life. You don't respawn or anything, you just die. So, yeah, it's basically just like a survival shooter, I guess. I love how the, um, the boss has, like, the logo for the game on it. Because that's originally, like, the application icon on the front of the ship for the Mac. Okay, that was very close. Have you felt so chill watching a arcade shooter? It is an extremely chill game. This game has... Yeah. How's it going, Genesis? Thanks. Welcome to the stream. This game has a way of making a sh uh, shmup like this, I guess, extremely chill. I think it's the music and the controls. And, like, just the, the whole floatiness of it just really works with this game. It's, it's very relaxing. And the backgrounds, it's easy on the eyes too. Yeah, like everything, all of the above. There are 25 stages by the way. So wave seven. And uh, when our bar is full at the bottom, we get a double shot. Which is really handy for like later stages. There's also a two player option, so... Probably easier to get through this game with two players. Um, unfortunately I'm a loner, so... Ken is trying to catch the ship on the screen. Oh, that's cute. I'm just too damn quick. I'm just too damn fast. And like, the music is in a loop. But it's, it's like such good music. Like, what other music would you want? This is just fantastic. Alright, another boss. And, uh, the bosses sort of remain the same. They just have slightly different patterns each time. And what you do is you just shoot the front of it. And, uh, basically wipe it out, so... Right, wave nine. This is when it starts to get a little hectic. And you kind of need to just pay attention to everything. Welcome back, Joker. Joker. 
How's it going? We're playing Meteor Storm. The space shooter. Pretty good. It's pretty good. Ba bam ba 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 ba. How am I? About the same, man. Can't complain. The same spot you left me, dude. Fuck, we've only got one shield. Really? Well, okay. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's sort of fuck, I died. Sort of mild here today as well. I mean it's not overly uh not overly warm or anything. I'm gonna try and keep all my shields this time. I reckon. Oh, really? Well, goddamn. We got the opposite. It's supposed to be really hot on Saturday. Like 27 degrees or something. Something crazy like that. Oh well, I guess it is what it is. Shit. We can pick up more shield. Ah, uh, they come in the form of asteroids. But they're quite hard to come by. This game just wants you dead, basically. Like, immediately dead. We just need to fill the bar on the bottom to, uh, on the bottom to get full shields again. Okay, again. Boom! All right. Stages are sort of easy. May the force be with you. Okay. Do 
Hey, hey, hey! That was close. Wonder how it would feel to uh, come in zero gravity. Um, probably get it all over you. I don't know. Never really thought about that. How's it going, Combo? Welcome to the stream. It's going good. Playing some... Meteor Storm. This is a space shooter I used to play all the time growing up. Uh, got a Steam release. It's very nice to play, but... It's quite difficult. This was originally on the Macintosh. Came out for PC. It's a, it's a good time. Right, wave seven. What's media about it? Just a meaty game. Look at it. Wouldn't you want to play this? This game is sexy, man. And uh, the developer reached out to me as well. He's like, I never thought I would see this game on YouTube. And thanks for playing my game. So, that's, it's, it's an honor when the dev does that kind of thing. Probably shoot very far, yes. Daniel Berserk, how's it going? We're talking about coming in space. You're, uh, you've come at the right moment. Ha! See what I did there? Anyway, welcome to the stream. Playing, uh, Meteor Storm. Alright, good. Uh, did you say hello, Dev? I play all kinds of stuff. Can't imagine. Sponsor me or else. That would be pretty sick. Though, I think Zed Sculpt, who made this, is a very, very small company. <laughs> Maybe even like a one-man company. But yeah, it is... It is pretty cool when, uh, when devs go out of their way to, like, you know, compliment the player. So I can compliment the game even more. Meaty and girthy. Best business choices always started with random threats. So they say, yeah. Random threats and, uh, turns to a handshake. Whoops. Yep, so, uh, you know, I'm doing a stream for, of this game, because I think it'll be cool to just, like, upload it on YouTube. I don't think this is the type of game someone would stream. Um, because it's so simple, you know? This is something you would play in your own time, but... Since I have a special, like, memory with this game... I, I feel like it's only right to stream it. It deserves all my attention 
and it deserves all your attention because it holds a special place in me like yeah this is cool to watch yeah it's only like a three dollar game but you know i i have so much memory with this game it's it's great soothing music that's what sort of gets you through and keeps pl and keeps you playing. Even though there's only like two tracks in this game, the the music doesn't get stale at all because it's just so calm, you know. Though I'm not really calm when I'm playing it though, and new backgrounds as well each time. Different backgrounds also keeps you coming back. Because, you know, it gives the game another sort of flavour as you approach each, like, wave. I don't know, the game feels different as you keep progressing. I think that's shield, yeah. The yellow thing. <laughs> you're pretty. No, you're pretty. Pretty much Joker, yeah. <laughs> Majestic. Yeah, I, I know you two guys' love for each other. God damn. Oh, we're not doing too bad. Should have a statue of me? In... In memorial of what? Not that I passed, or in relation of what? Tell me I'm pretty. Your breathtaking combo. <laughs> yeah, with the hairstyle and everything. Yeah, is that... Is that weird that I was just imagining that? A statue of me with like the mad scientist curly hairstyle and all that? It's kind of weird that I was imagining that for myself. Statue of inspiration and perseverance. Of, uh, of jank video games. Pretty much. <laughs> That's what it would be. Actually, chat is getting me through this game. I'm glad I streamed this. It's a distraction from the difficulty. A status version of me. Oh, you got a, yeah, 3D printer statue of me in, like, your, your local town square or something. Right, wave 14 of 25. The levels are only going to get harder from now on. I think past wave 15, it gets ridiculous. The screen just gets full of... Enemies. Okay, get that. There we go. That was a cakewalk. I got ditchy nose. Pause it. Also got water on my semi-new chair. Can't have that. Oh, 
My dome tree is the same, same as our days of gamers. It isn't dome. Definitely isn't dome. But yeah, has the same structure as a Doom game. Doom 2016 is my favourite. Uh, Doom Eternal feels too cluttered. I need to focus here. Tetris vibes? I can uh, definitely see that Joker, yeah. Right, boss time. By the way, these bosses get harder. Thankfully, they're sort of floaty, so you can hit them. You can hit them where it hurts. And I think their bars get longer as well. Like their boss bars. And they're a little more trolly when it comes to the screen. Ah. Uh, yeah, down the bottom of the screen. Watching YouTube stuff about UFOs, sharks, sea monsters. Well, what else would you watch if you're sick? Or when you're sick? Graph music. There, I've read chat. Fuck, two shields left. Fuck, I'm dead. 29,000. Okay, let's do that again. So, I would have been on level 16. Is that wave one? Yes. Do 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 Eh, I'll get that. Why not? Excuse me. Itchy nose. Not picking my nose, by the way. Just a niche. Uh, Meteor Storm. M-E- It's at the top of the screen, Joker. It's right above my head. <laughs> it's in the stream title, too. Eyeballs, please. Whose nose am I picking? It's always someone else's nose. Whoa! Dude, I just destroyed the boss in like two hits. What the heck? Probably because I had like a double blaster power up. That was like pretty fast. <laughs> Easy boss, it's because I had a power up. 
I went in there with the right uh, weapon set. Go. Uh, where you up to in Doom 2016 at the moment, ISO? Ah, uh, maybe. It might be a bit of a crime, though. The fourth room. Oh, okay, you've barely... Barely started. It gets really cool later on. I get, like, Plutonia vibes. With, like, the later levels of Doom. Because they introduce, like, vines and stuff. I'm running into everything, aren't I? Ah, I'm only on wave five. This is bad. Feels more like Gears of War to you. You didn't care for the modern dooms? Fair enough. The original is where it's at anyway. Oh, you mean the, uh, Doom 3, indie. Doom 3 is amazing. Love that game. Okay, I'm crapping. I'm gonna have to play a bit better than this. Indeed, not as many I- f yeah. There's probably no original soundtrack uploaded then. Maybe I'll upload the soundtrack someday. I know, this game is very little known. So, there's probably not a soundtrack. Properly. But, if you want me to upload one, I'll be more than happy. I'll do the menu screen. I'll do this in-game music, and I'll do the boss music. If you really want me to. What's Super Stardust? Is that an Amiga game? Fight demons to push farts back. True. A 10 hour OST. Uh, I'll see what I can do, Joker. All I have to do is hit record on OBS and uh, keep the game running. But yeah, three tracks won't take long to, uh, record. Oh! I've got a way of doing it. I could just leave it running for, like, 30 minutes or something. I don't know. Depends how, how long you want to, uh, listen to it for. Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, I don't want to frickin' die, man. No. You could also buy the game as well, Joker. 
That's another option. It's not like this game is extremely obscure, like... If it's on Steam, it's gonna get noticed more. It's gonna get more of a... More highlighted. But, I guess the people who don't want to buy the game... Just upload the soundtrack. It is on Steam! <laughs> it is on Steam! Look up Meteor Storm. This is exactly what I'm playing it off. Uh, it's exactly what I was explaining. Yes. Ah, okay. Well, if you wish but you barely use Steam, that's interesting. I know, I use Steam constantly. Because, you know, gaming. Wave six, here we come. Ah, uh, twenty five. So my PB is fifteen. Well, my PB for this stream. I probably made it to like wave 20 in the past. But yeah, this stream I've got to level 15, which is pretty good. I'll do my best. I've got full shields right now, so this is looking promising on wave seven. 25, two five, not 20. Tyrion is okay. Tyrion has too many menus, though. Love the music, though. Four shields better than one. Don't we all lie, Sokola? Exactly. <laughs> Don't we all? That's what, that's what makes life interesting. That our uh, Karens exist. I'll try not to. We're good. Alright, this is the one. I think I've only got a couple more attempts and then... Uh, it's dinner time. She tried to get her friend to fight you apparently. Huh. That sounds like a typical bar situation. <laughs> Not a dull moment happens at night time. Game, sleep, repeat. Don't forget work, Joker. Biggest ratio of Karens. 
Yep. Oh, totally. Yeah. We don't have many Karens down here. We have our share of annoying people. They exist everywhere, but... When it comes to specific types of characters like Karens... The US, 100%. Uh... The Deadhead Punk and Midnight Monopoly, thank you very much for the raid. Uh, I need to chuck my alert box up there. But, uh, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, what were you playing today? Uh, I'm just about to add my alert box now. We are playing a Meteor Storm. Originally came out on the Macintosh. Also, how you doing, Deadhead Punk? Uh, yeah, welcome in, guys. Really appreciate the raid. I'm on wave 10 of 25 in this game. It's more and more difficult. Feminist. Feminist big UFO cases. Can't recall one. The game is on Steam, yes. That's what I said. Good times. Meteor Storm, Cyber Trucker, welcome. Did you manage to finish full throttle? <laughs> you hope not. Full throttle looked fun. This was originally a Mac game, by the way. Just putting it out there, and it's on Steam. For like $3. This game is pretty good. It's Pog. Popping off. Ooh. You did lurk, lucked out of a famously hard pixel hunt. Was it on a specific screen, Cybertruck? It's cool. Super short, easy, except stupid pixel hunt. A oh, pixel hunt wall. Was that the one you ran into, Cyber Trucker? Uh, got to disc 2 of Final Fantasy 7. How are you finding, uh, Final Fantasy Midnight? That is a quite a widely streamed game on Twitch. Thanks for the shout out to Cyber Trucker Alpha. Appreciate it. A person mind array for us to suggest. Who is it, Joker fan? I've got enough people on my streaming list, I think. After this stream, I got like five people in mind. Yep, kicked it in on your fourth or fifth try. I got stuck there too, Cyber Trucker. Even though I haven't beaten the game, I know exactly what you're talking about. It's definitely a banger, yeah. Uh, hyped up is stupidly hard. I think he played the Mac version. Yeah. Of, um, of Full Throttle on Scum VM. Yeah. Unless I'm wrong, but yeah. Alright, level 12. Um, I've got him to level 15 in this stream. 15 of 25 in this game. How's it going, Scarlet? Run the stream. See a bit more refresh on yesterday's Doom mod. Uh, yesterday was kind of shit. In general. Just, yeah, all round. Wasn't feeling it, Scarlet, but I streamed anyway. I don't know. Sometimes. Sometimes you just get a certain way in your head, you know? Mac version doesn't load all DOS version voices. Runs the Mac version just fine. Nice. Yeah, the Mac release is exactly the same anyway, so... It's like... Yeah. 
Can I get to level 69? Uh, only if I play this game over and over and over. What is 69.25 or 25.69s? Do the math. So, uh, when is Hexen, Cyber Trucker? <laughs> I know you're looking forward to Hexen. Good to see. Yeah, I'm only human, Scarrick, so... I'm gonna be happy, I'm gonna be sad. I'm gonna be shitty, I'm gonna be grumpy. Like... Life affects us all all over the place. back the flower pots. Shit. That yeah, has a nice atmosphere. It does. It's very, uh, very relaxing. It is indie. It is. Alright. I just don't really show it because, you know, I'm in front of a live audience. I don't really want to show my fucking... Mental insecurities, because it's fine. Ah, uh, 14. Twitches for games, not, not bitching about whatever else is happening in your outside life. Shit, yeah we do. Alright. This is a uh, serious time. Do my best here to push through. Uh, it's reserved. Yeah, hot tub streamers. They're probably like the most insecure people on this platform. Wave 15, let's go. Are they using shields more frequently? Um... Even though your backdrop is probably in every level, you don't mind the look. Uh, it's not in every level, Skarik. The background changes, like, through three stages or so. So, it's like, yeah. The whole game kind of shifts, but essentially, it's the same gameplay. I just like how it changes every now and again. I'm dead. They might be pretty secure. Well, let's try this again. 25th anniversary. I'm on... So, I got to like wave 17, I think? Let's try this again. Was it 15? Okay. Uh, yeah, it's on Steam Isocola. It's a leaderboard. Universally. Yeah, it takes some patience for these games and knowing where the enemies are and when they're going to shoot, types of attacks as well. Excuse me.
Go! Whoa, that was close. Alright, perfected that stage. Trying to speed run my way to uh, to where I just was. Mermaid sperm. I feel like kid on Saturday morning just watching these. Uh, rerun of Transformers. It's a, it's a nice feeling, Skarik. This is like Galaga on crack. Pretty much deadhead punk. Yeah. Though I've like barely touched Galaga. This is probably my second space shooter ever. I don't know, second or third on stream. Because I don't really play these games much. They are fun games, though. This is a rare occasion that I'll be playing a game like this. Thank you very much for the follow. Really appreciate it. Just spend your Christmas painting 40k figures. Nice. Can get pretty crazy. Yeah, I've heard those games are like sort of out of control. Uh, score farming space shooters. Pretty much. Almost died there. It's okay. We'll get it. I just gotta keep repeating these stages. Bullet hells, man. Okay. Gotta try and keep my shields in good form. Keeping them check. Every opportunity I have to grab a power up, I will. We go. Ah. Right. Uh, yes and no, Cont. We got to wave 15. The game gets pretty difficult, so... I'm getting better and better, though. That's the thing with these games. It's like muscle memory. But at the same time, everything is so random on the screen. It's like... Should have kept your points till the end. Imagine that. I'm pretty low on shield. Wave 8.
Can I please get shields? Not that evil though. Uh, any viewer is evil. Don't underestimate the power of random people on Twitch chat. If they know they have, they can do something against the streamer, they will. <laughs> If they know the advantage is there, they can act on it. Or the opportunity, you know? Alright. This is the final attempt. And then, unfortunately, I gotta hop off. Some streams are so, uh, mechanic? Oh, masochistic, you mean? Uh, dead punk? Or uh, relentless? Because that's true. Johnny make a hot dog with fried onions and some hot sauce. Oh, like a... Yeah, yeah, the main fruition of chat is to mess the streamer up. I get you. That sounds really nice, Isacola. I wish I had sausages. I have noodles and eggs. I do have some beef mints in the fridge as well. Oh no. Okay, I'm getting careless. I don't want to get careless. Once upon a time, I had full shields. Now I don't have many shields. There we go. In the hole! Get down. Alright, good. Wave 11, I'm so far away. I feel so far away from my, my goal. Anyway. Fuck. Uh, this is not good. Oh, that was a save. Holy shit. Okay, I thought I was dead for reals there. Ah! Good. Go for it, ISO. It's a good challenge. I mean, unless you want to hit start and do two-player with me. That would be a little more fair. 
Oh, is this the boss? Just melt it. <laughs> Hit start. I wonder if there's like twice as many enemies in two player mode? It's probably about the same, honestly. Let's go, level uh, 14. And level 15. I'm not too far away from full shields. I've got one more to fill the bar at the bottom and then full shields. Look at that. You get full shields and a double shot. Okay, 15. That's if you don't fuck it up. Yeah, baby. Yeah, buddy. Right. Oh, look at all the asteroids. This is chaos. All the explosions. Here we go. Scrape the boss. This is bad. You best. I heard that sound. Not the best of the best, but you best. No, 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 no. Ah, he's got one more hit. There we go. Hey, yay, yay. Okay. Fuck, I'll try, man. I'm getting nervous. The nerves aren't helping, dude. T quit smashing. Get that! Okay. That double shot uh, was worth nothing because I need shields. 17. Oh man, I'm flying right into everything, aren't I? Ah, fuck! Shit. It's really easy to get carried away. Alright, those are- that's the GG's. What's the story? That nasty iron army has chosen your meteor belt as its next sector of space to conquer. Mega Bomb and Metal... Metal Moth want to pulverize you and your puny little fleet of redeemed fighters into the next light year. You are just, are you just gonna sit there and let them do this? No way. So power up your oxidizer spacecraft and go blast some aliens. But wait, before you go, you'll need to know what's out there, right? Okay, first thing you're gonna run into is a 
Clinker. Ah, uh, Clin? Clinker? This is the basic drone of the Iron Army. You're not very smart, but just be careful when you blast them. They might catch you off guard. After you've trashed enough of these guys, it's on to the next wave. Where things get a little tougher for you. If you think you can handle that, think you can handle that? Of course you can. Then let's take a look at what typical wave in the meteor storm will have in store for you. <laughs> Metal Aloft wants to pulverize you. Has to get past your giant steel old man balls first. Ah, uh, yada yada, interface HUD. You got all your power ups there, general meteors, ships, and for weapons. Uh, these are bosses. Sometimes in Theros of Death, an exploded enemy or erupt or similar plasma balls. Avoid these to survive. Cool! Alright, well, unfortunately that's the stream. I, I would keep attempting that game, but... Uh, as it is, and as it was, I am getting sort of hungry, so... Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah. And lurking and following and subbing and bidding and raiding. I'll probably be back tomorrow. I'll try and be back tomorrow. I'll just turn down the sound a bit. I know you guys are getting blasted. I needed to turn it up for that game anyway. We'll continue Zargon. I don't know if you guys want to see more Meteor Storm. Maybe we'll go back to that game in the future. I will indeed enjoy my food. Uh, let's see who's online. Oh, we got Retro Bear streaming Sin Episodes Emergence. Avuzel playing Star Wars Dark Forces. Kyle. Eh. Uh, probably gonna go to Retro Bear tonight. Have a good egg noodle soup. Sounds delicious. Alright, as of a day ago. As in, in terms of shoutouts, Yuguni has followed. MXD with the follow. Pont with the 101 bits, thank you very much. But not Monopoly with the raid. And the Deadhead Punk with the follow. Alright, let's go on raid. Retro Bear. He's playing Sun Episodes Emergence. Good streamer. From the Philippines. Plays a lot of FPS games, and, uh... Sin Episodes is... Amazing. It's just too bad they didn't... Uh... Continue the, the trilogy. Imagine what you look like, Disease 3. 3. Alright, guys. I'm peacing out, and have a good one. Thank you, Chozo Brain. Alright. Raid out. Let's go. Bye. Not sure you get the reference. Bye. Hydrate. Bye.